All right, guys, I'm going to talk a little bit about uh, one of the big topics going around right now on YouTube and all over the place about fake weights, about people using fake weights in videos and photo shoots and things like that. Uh, a lot of names are coming up. Cali Muscle right now uh, is getting a little flack for using fake weights. Rich Piana, of course, had a big thing with Boston Lloyd. Lloyd didn't want to use fake weights in the photo shoot, which is cool. Nothing wrong with that. Uh, and then, of course, Brad Castleberry. Um, he, uh, there's a lot of videos out about him possibly uh, using fake weights in his videos, which, you know, he probably does, but, you know, it is what it is. And here's a pic right here. I think where he's curling. Uh, yeah, 405. I don't know what that is, but, uh, you know, it's, it's, and it seems to be the big topic of the day. Now, one of the things that's interesting, though, is if you take a look at some of this stuff. Now, this is John Pierre Fuchs. Foops, Fox, I don't know how he pronounced his last name, but uh, big, you know, in the 1990s, I think he was a popular bodybuilder, but his career ended uh, in a photo shoot trying to squat a shit ton of weight. Uh, so this is what happens, you know, when you don't use fake weights in a photo shoot. A lot of times in a photo shoot, people are not prepared for those maximum weights. So that's why I think a lot of times, it, it, you know, they do use fake weights and nobody gets hurt. Now, am I a fan of using fake weights? No, I'm not. I'm just saying, you know, who really gives a shit? I mean, we're not going to be able to suppress this. Anybody with the brain uh, knows when you see a picture of fake weights like this, you know, obviously. And you can actually buy fake weights. Here's a website actually called Fake Weights uh, Studio Series. Two pair, 159 bucks. Uh, <laughs> so apparently it is a big deal. And they, all, they are uh, out there. And there's a lot of people using them, I guess, for photo shoots, that kind of thing. But just remember, you know, uh, it is what it is. And to the trained eye, I mean, it's not that difficult. I think there's a video, this girl right here squatting like 500 pounds. She's like a supermodel. That's the big thing right now. Obviously, she's not doing that. The bar's not even bent. I mean, you'd have to be a complete moron. But then again, the general public a lot of times pretty naive. So, I mean, I get that, uh, but... You know, who really cares? I mean, to, to, to all of us who actually, you know, know anything about weightlifting, weight training, I mean, you can spot fake weights a mile away, but, uh, you know, it is it is what it is. It's kind of interesting. I mean, if, or they say if the bar is not bending, you're just pretending. But even then, I mean, this guy right here could have, you know, three of these could be fake weights. Who knows? But uh, it is one of those things. But anyway, I don't know if it's really that big a deal. We're not going to do anything to change it. 